Hello everyone. Bus booking website module will help in managing the transport business to manage bus booking from the website page. Real time bus booking can also be made through this module. It will help in managing the routes. This module will have a dependency on the bus booking backend module. If you have any doubts in that configuration part, just check that video we are added for your reference. After enabling all the configurations, now let's get into the website. So from here you can see and bus booking menu. Let's get into that where you can just book and bus. We need to add the start point as well as the end point. Here we can just add the dates. Okay, so for I'm um, adding a date as today and here we can add a bus type. So it may be the 15 seat bus and also if it, if it is in a sleeper bus, you can just choose it a sleeper right away here. Now I'm going to choose an 15 seater bus. Okay. Now I'm going to search whether any buses are available in between these dates or not. Yes, there will be one bus will be available. You can see the routes. Okay. And you can see the bus name, start point, end point, bus type, date. And also you can see the total seat will be 15 and the remaining seat will be the 9. Okay. And you can see the start time as well as the end time right away here. Now let's book for the bus. So here you can see that if it is in this color, it will be an available seat. If it is booked, you can see those things in the red. And if it is selected, you can just see those things in the green. Now let's add and pick a point and also the draw point. You can see the price right away here and you can see the amenities. You can see what are the amenities that we have added for each and every bus can also be seen here. Now let's show and bus seat. You can see that these are the bus seats are booked and these are in the free state. Okay. Now let's select an available bus for two. And in this, we need to add a name, email ID. You can add the age, gender, as well as the phone number of end customer. So from here, after filling all the informations, just user can click on the checkout page where you can see and bus, bus tickets will be based on end seat number, customer name, email, age, gender, as well as the number. Now let's process checkout. Okay. Now let's pay now. So after completing the payment, we can see those orders from the backend. So let's get into the backend. Now in this backend page, let's get into the bus booking where you can see the tickets. And this is the ticket that we have placed now. And you can see all the informations about each and every passengers like email ID, seat number, age, gender, number, and also the confirmation status can also be seen here. And for more information, you can see the bus details as well. Here you can see the pickup point, drop points, start time as well as the end time and also the journey details can also be seen here. Okay. So for trip information, you can just click in that. You can see all the trip informations for each and every trip can also be seen here. Okay. So there you can see all the information about each and every passengers and here you can see the start date, end date and also the start time as well as the end point. Okay. So from this page itself, we can just use a register payment option to complete the payment and also you can use a confirmation option and then from here itself, you can just create an invoice. Now let's register payment for this particular order that we have placed. Now the payment will be done. You can see the state will be changed to the sale order state. So once the payment done from here in the print option there, we can see and ticket report. We can just print and ticket report from here. You can see all the information like ticket number, journey date, start point, end point, start time as well as the end time. You can see all the ticket details like seat number, customer name, email ID, age, gender, number, Booking status, unit price, as well as the overall amount can also be seen here in this ticket report. In this way, we can make use of this module to help and manage the transport business to manage bus booking from the website page. If you have any queries regarding this video, you can ask in the comment box. We will definitely solve your queries. And if you feel this video is helpful to you, you can like this video and subscribe our YouTube channel for more Odoo related updates. Thanks for watching.